Hi everyone and welcome back with another video of Excel tutorial series. In this video we will see how to convert image into the data in Microsoft Excel. So without further ado I will just jump into my Microsoft Excel and will show you how to convert the image into the actual data in Microsoft Excel. So here's my Excel sheet. I am on the Microsoft 365 suite because image to data is a new feature in Microsoft Excel and it's only available in uh, the desktop version which is Microsoft 365. So if you're using the older version so this method might not be for you you can uh, use the second method as uh, indicated in this video. So this is our image uh, in which we have case, company name, division, region and number in the region. It's just a simple data set for the demonstration purpose and I will convert this data this image into the actual uh, Excel data. To do so, you just need to go to the data tab in the uh, Excel and there's an option data from picture. Just select this data from picture. It will ask for a picture from you. Just upload the image. It will analyze your image for you. It will take some time. And now it opens up a uh, data from picture menu uh, for you. The entries which are highlighted in red because they are low confidence cell, Excel has low confidence on them and they want you to review this data. So I will click on review. So I will compare this data from here and I will accept if it is uh, all right or I will just edit it if it's not correct. I will edit it and the third one it's looking good. The fourth one is the fifth one I'll edit it as two because it's giving me a post copy in front of it I international house of ports I will just accept it accept it accept this one so there are no items to uh, review now so I will just click on insert data and it's saying that you are responsible for validating the accuracy of all the data I will just click on insert data. I will just expand these uh, columns. So it gives me a better view. Now you can see that Excel has just converted this image into the actual Excel data for me. I will just close this one out. So uh, now you can see that you can just edit these uh, fields and you can do anything you want to do with this uh, particular data set. So now what if you are uh, using an older version of the uh, Microsoft Excel. Uh, so this feature won't be available for you. For example if I open my Microsoft Excel 2019. As you can see here in the data tab there is no option of converting an image into the actual Excel data set. So uh, what I will do. I will just go to my uh, mobile phone and I will download the Microsoft Excel from Play Store or the App Store. Then I will open up my Microsoft Excel. As you can see my Microsoft Excel is open. I will just uh, open a new blank workbook. And from here I will just go to this option on the bottom left corner. And I will just choose this uh, image to data option. It will open up camera for me. I will. I can just take a snapshot of a printed sheet as well. And, or I, I can upload the image from my gallery. And here's my image. I'll just select my image. And now it will ask you to crop the image. Uh, so that your entire data fits in. Or choose the data which you want to insert in your Excel sheet. I'll just crop it and I'll uh, click on continue and it will open up extracting table window for me. Uh, it will take some time and now it will just uh, ask you to review your data. I'll edit it as and then call it as case. Then the next one is this one. It's not correct. The accuracy is low so I will call it as division. Then this one is good. Let's ignore. This one is not correct. This one is a region. So I will just correct it. And number and division. I can just see which of my fields are correct and which are not. 
and I can then review my data. International House of Wards. And this one is correct. So I will ignore this one, ignore this one, and ignore this one. And this one is looking good. There are no red fields in my data right now. So I'll just click on open. And you can see that Excel has converted this image into the actual data for me. Now, if I want to open this uh, sheet in my desktop, so simply I can just share this document as an attachment and click on the workbook option. And I can just share it either by email or on WhatsApp, and then I can open it on my desktop. So that's it for this video. I hope you like this one. Thank you so much for watching and have a good day. Bye.